In this video, I am explaining you how to install Keyclock on your local machine. Let's get started. As prerequisites, you should have Java 11 installed on your machine. In order to install Keyclock, first I need to download the Keyclock server from their website. I visit the website, it is keyclock.org. Here you can see their home page. In order to download the server, I visit downloads page. You can see here, at the moment, the latest version is 19.0.3. I need to download the Keylock server. Again you can see, there are multiple options available to download the Keylock server. From that, I am using the distribution powered by Quarkus. From here, I download the zip file. Now I am in the folder where I have downloaded the Keyclock 19 zip file. Now I am going to extract it using unzip command. Ok, unzipping is complete. Now I am going to go inside this unzipped folder. Here you can see there are multiple folders such as bin, conf, lib, providers, themes. In order to run Keyclock, I visit the bin folder. Here you can see kc.sh script. In order to run Keyclock, I need to execute this file. As the prerequisites, I mentioned that you should have Java 11 installed on your machine. I have Java 11 installed in my machine, so I directly run this script. slash kc dot sh. Here I start the server in dev mode. First, it takes some time to start the server. Now the server is running and it is listening to this particular IP and port. Now I am going to access this website. Here I type localhost 8080 and press enter. On your first visit you need to set up an admin user. Here I provide the username as admin and password is also as admin. You can provide any username or password you like. User is created. Now I need to click this administration console link to login. Here I provide my credentials. Username is admin. Again password is also admin. And I click sign in. Okay. I was successfully redirected to admin console. Now I believe you have an idea to download and install Keyclock server. If you have any question, please put them in the comment area. See you in the next video. Thank you very much.